Hey, it's Coolio if you don't know, and it is time for some more of the extra long run where we are playing Xenoblade Chronicles 3. So, um, last time, pretty much what Mobius said about uh, the entire world being against us came to fruition. Um, Team Noah is no longer welcome among the Kavesi forces, and Team Mio is no longer welcome uh, among the Agnian forces, so we've kind of melded together and are now heading south to hopefully somewhere where we can uh, figure out what our next course of action will be. Come on, who else? Um, who do I want to play out? Every day's a training day. I should write this all down. <laughs> that was an interesting accidental exchange that just happened. Whoa, got a rare doodah right here. Huh? This is new. Oh, what's that? How shiny. I want it. Yeah. Thank you. Odd square sharp. Ooh. Yeah, that is an ether deposit over there, too. Um. Oh. It's able. We should harvest this ether. Well, it wasn't all that much, but hey. Someday we will need a lot of them. And so every bit helps. What do we got here? Right, so we were doing a quest for Riku and Banana. Um, we gotta get a glaring eye though. Guys, get ready to fight. Uh oh. We face pulled a crap ton of stuff. Then go off, too. All right. What? Do we have another one? We do have another one. These guys are everywhere. Saying. And obtain the materials. 
Oh, you look friendly. Are you the thing that we're supposed to kill? That's the one we have to take down. It looks a little tough. Hey, ain't nothing like a post meal workout. Got your number, mate. Uh, 16, alright. Of course, y'all scatter when I put this thing down. Stand in the circle, guys. Just outside. Oh, geez, you just topple everyone and almost kill everyone. Okay, that that wasn't cool. We're gonna need some other plan. Ugh. This thing's handling our asses, handing our asses to us. If we don't get a grip. We'll end up at its premier workout instead. What friends do we? There are six of you. What is point of numbers if all fight separate and not together? Fight together? Alright then, I guard, then everyone else pile in while it's distracted. What, and run right into the Sparker's jaws? Yeah, no. It's way better taking his turn sniping at it from a distance. Neither of those plans is effective against the If you ask me, but Mimi, do something. Never be able to fight together if everyone's got their own idea. Yeah, we have to pick a plan and stick with it. Oh, now we got chain attacks, huh? Chain attack is, is a special powerful technique which allows party members to take turns strategically performing arts. Performing combos, cancelling into arts, and achieving roll actions all help build up the chain attack gauge. Once it's completely full, press plus to trigger the attack. I was wondering where this was. Like, it's it's in every Xenoblade game. Go ahead and chain attack. Upon starting a chain attack, you will see three orders. You can compare, compare the completion bonuses to be gained by completing each order and choose whether uh, choose whose order to go with. First, choose whose order you want to follow. Oh, you're letting me pick. Select party members and attack using arts. Select party members and hit with arts to collect tactical points with characters awarding different values. Reach 100% tactical points or more to complete the order. You can maximize bonus tactical point gain by using characters with the same affiliation or role as the order or meeting other conditions, so try uh, try out all of the different possibilities. Fulfill the criteria for the acting party member's role to impart special effects that could aid your chain attack. First Blood. Using an attacker to make the first strike will knit you a large amount of tactical points. 
point limit. Attacking with a healer guarantees that the total tactical points doesn't exceed 99%. Back in action, complete an order with a defender to reactivate the character with the most tactical points. Complete the order successfully by reaching 100% tactical points. Subjugation. Cool. <laughs> oh. Completing an order triggers the chain art, adding a powerful attack to the sequence and ending the chain attack round. Party members can get another turn if you do well. You can choose another order and keep the chain going if the chain gauge isn't empty and you still have members who can act. Select an order to continue the chain effect. When the chain gauge is fully depleted, or when there are no available party members left who can act, the chain attack will end and you'll be shown the, the results. Well, Let's go heal people. kind of feeling it right now. Let's go Days. Okay. We got Days covered. Whoa, that went way better than before. That's teamwork for you, huh? Miku rated 3 out of 5 stuff. I also have the feeling no one friends still, for the for lack of a better word, lack. With practice, Miku think friends can pull off bigger and stronger special teamwork moves. Patronizing much, Flop Paul? It's probably right though. It's only been days since we've started, since we've started traveling together. We should probably learn each other's fighting styles little by little, and we're bound to see results. I fully agree. Uh, either way, we got Riku's... whatchamacallit? Let's head for the Oasis? Ho 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 ho! Time is nigh for Riku to impart teachings of gem crafting. I realize I'm like... I realize I'm kind of falling in and out of the uh, of the accent sometimes, but uh, guess now we've left the army. We've got to handle stuff like this ourselves. It's a tough break, but we'll just have to take things as they come. Huh. Good thing we found this. Okay, since friends squeaking with anticipation, Riku teach art of gem crafting. In point of fact, for craft gems, in addition to materials that, ga that gather earlier, also need gemstone for base. 
Huh, there's more to it than I thought. But no cause for concern. This time Riku have own reserve, so we use that. Shop thinking, Riku. Thanks. Now, Riku set up apparatus. First step, set, gem, uh, set gemstone here. That work has base a uh, substrate into which material is introduced, and then process. When do so, can express various useful effects. Finally, equip and enjoy. Right, right. If friends grasp, grasp principle, all that's left is to put it into practice. Rest spots, you can use items to craft gems. They can have a number of beneficial effects for characters when equipped on them, so craft as many as you can. Oh, let's give it a try. Cool. I've been wanting one of those. In the craft gems menu, you can use the items you have gathered to craft gems. A gem can only be crafted once you've gathered all the necessary materials. For now, try crafting Ironclad Lamp. Okay. Ah, okay. Ironclad. Okay. Hold on the button. Nothing to be sniffed at. No bad job. Now you've crafted a gem, exit the map. And that concludes process. Ah, wow, that took yonks. Should not expect to go as fast or smooth as when doing colony with proper equipment. Still, I think we got the gist. Might go quicker the second time around. Noah, please do apply product to now. I'm on it. Once crafted, Gems can be equipped to, uh, by any number of party members by characters, gems in the main menu. As your characters gain levels, they'll eventually be able to equip up to a total of three gems. Each gem grants a unique effect. Customize them as suits your role and balance them. Gems can be equipped to each character. Select characters now. Now select gems. Select a gem slot. You only have one now, but as you level up, you can unlock a maximum of three slots. Select the gem you want to equip from the list. Now that you've equipped the gem, exit the menu. There we go. Let's see just how strong it's gotten, yeah? It's already night time. Can I wait till morning? Oh, you're right. With right materials, can create gems with all kinds of properties. Master art of gem crafting, and even Gonzalez has become easy peasy like tiny little bonnet. When find new materials, Riku craft new gems together. Manana can make all sorts of dishes if have big choice of ingredients. And also arrange dishes dishes and courses and menus and accord to color and Alright, put a sock in it, we get it. Well, I think that's probably enough for today. Let's bunk down. So I'll take first watch. We may be able to conserve more energy if we leave before sunrise. Yeah, thanks. Good night. Hot as usual. We better cover as much distance as we can before it gets even harder. 
I estimate we're about halfway through this wilderness. Hang in there, Mimi. You can do it. Yeah, I guess. Alright, let's roll out! Roger. We'll push on until the Ruby Flats. And there we go. We got to learn a couple of things out of that. We learned our uh, chain attacks and uh, gems. So, good stuff. That's not who I'm trying to target, game. I'm trying to target uh, a large friend over here. What level are you? Level 51. No thanks. Mio, are you dealing better with the heat? I'm doing fine today, thanks. I felt quite better than yesterday, anyway. I'm stuck on the geometry here. Not go that way. Oops, they found us. You're dealing with me. Perfect time. We had a minute to go. You do that. So I wonder if um the chain attack gauge is like in other games where um it does somewhat carry over from fight to fight, but it goes down. I'm still curious as to why they bothered with the um, the whole um, ether clock. Because, but it's weird to, it's weird to have a mechanic that you're going to have for like relatively like two seconds in the game. Oh, you're exciting, aren't you? Let's give you a try. Sure. Oh, this 
this uh oh jeez and i was gonna say this fight is not nearly as hard as uh where is neo okay game is nice enough to actually tell me hey this character is running low on health you're the healer get up in there Also interesting how there's an item literally called the Red Rum Steel. Red Rum is backward from murder. It's murder steel. Murder death metal steel. Okay, so it looks like the chain attack is like strictly per battle because uh, it shouldn't have gone down that much. Oh yeah, I forgot food buffs. Those are a thing. I currently have one. Never seen this place before. Hey, can I ask you something? It's special, isn't it? Your blade, I mean. Um... Sometimes one part of it glows. Why is that? Oh. You can tell. That's amazing. It's hard not to. Oh, right. Is it a secret? No. I can tell you. But I won't.
Noah, my man. He's still playing around with that little toy. Have you considered a knock-on weapon? You might actually get somewhere with that. Oi! You deaf or what, Noah? Garvel? Noah, this is bad. <laughs> Not even a peep. Don't need to pay us any attention. Oh, please. I wasn't ignoring you. Once I finish this set, we can chat! <gasps> well, what were you saying? Noah! For dead weight, you're a right snuffing peacock! You... you slippery little mudder! <laughs> well, anything else? You snuffing weakling! Blast it all! Oh, you get it now! Lance! Break it up now. Didn't know you'd be so petty, Garvel. <laughs> Ain't got no time for this muscle head. Wanna say that again? Hm. We'll settle this properly in tomorrow's trial. Move it! Uh, Noah, are you okay? Don't let it get to you. Guys like that are the first ones to snuff it in a real battle. No, I'm not worried about him. I really can't call my weapon, though. I worry I'll end up being a burden. Never thought that here, not even once. Thanks. Kind of you to say. It's just the truth. Where are you going? To visit Riku, since it broke. The trial, it's tomorrow. I'm gonna need a new weapon for that. What's this? Magic sword, Lucky Seven. In distant past were seven legendary swordsmith pawn. Over course of seven years, forged sword from seven types of steel. No other sword like it in existing. Magic? Lucky seven? Let's please to give good cleave with blade and split clean in halves. Sure about that. Better not call some you break it, you bought it. Sneaky sort of deal. Riku would never dream. Just put all of heft into mighty swing. Weird ask. Uh, sure. You want me to cut it? I'll cut it, I guess. Here it comes. Beans, beans. There's not even a nick in it. Friends surprised? Indeed, his most prized of swords. <laughs> even armor of Ferronis gets sliced to itsy bits. I think I'll pass. Pass? So you not have need for? Yeah, it's too strong. Hmm. No one lands and friends to kick buckets? No, what the spark? Same as letting friends die. No, it's not. If friends not fight, cannot survive. Sure, but I don't need to use your sword. Then, why no one not call Blade? It's not our choice, I just can't. False. Riku see through like transparent. <sighs> Noah can call Blade. Just no big desire of fighting spirit. Riku? Hey, is he serious? Noah? What the? All this time? Huh? 
if death is not option, should live. Only way is fight like life depends. Thinking of self alone is way of coward. Though, Riku no feeling well. I'm afraid. Of fighting, you mean? Of this world. It's so brutal and relentless. And I'm afraid of what we might... become. Mate. Ho oh, ho ho! Riku knew Noah was hero material. Huh? It true this sword possess incredible power. Might even rob enemies of many much lives, yes. But only those who understand nature of terror have right to wield. Eh, quoth Master Pon of Riku, anyhaps. <laughs> so, if Noah can call Blade now, can still keep Lucky Seven, maybe in some kind of disguise. In different words, can turn it into sheath. Sheath? Can use it in fights like normal. But if ever push come to shove, time will come when Noah truly need Lucky Seven's strength. Then is only matter of drawing. When I truly need its strength. Exact. If Noah never lose sight of that feeling, one day such time surely come. That is, if I can master it. If felt to master, just give back. Can pick out different one. Ah. Uh. Right. Please not to feel specially indebted to Riku. Just take. No need for overthinkings. <laughs> okay. I accept your offer. Oh, and Riku? What is? Mind if I change the name? Me? Lucky Seven just isn't doing it for me. Did you end up picking? Huh? Um, name. Uh huh. You don't want to say. Or what? Is it that embarrassing? N no, it's not embarrassing. That's not it. <laughs> I'm getting strong emotional vibes here. I wouldn't say emotional per se, rather something I miss. You know, you're the second one that's noticed this weapon. Really? Is that something special? It is. And the first? Who was it? She's incredible. And we owe her our lives. Yeah, and she's out for your lives now. Changing the time. Go to System Change Time in the main menu to change the time of day to whenever you want it to. And you might be wondering, what does that accomplish? Um, well, there are some enemies that will only show up, say, during the day or during the night. Or during perhaps some types of weather, depending on uh, which game you're playing. I think this is how it goes. I don't think this game has um, okay. a weather system. Have it. Set up our overly complicated ladders again. Wait. Oh, what good! You're dealing with me! Appreciate you! 
Uh, let's get this guy in, in the fight too. Oh jeez. will be sketchy. Yeah, agreed. What friends afraid of, hmm? I'm seeing signs of patrols. Was it Colony 4? Colony 4? Colony of Bad But Elites, led by a commander of great repute. <laughs> whole rest Bad of Kevis acknowledge their superiority. Are you certain? This is Neil Valley. Right. Like Riku said. But how can this be? How can their zone of control extend this far out? Huh? Anyone feel that? <gasps> A quake? Hmm. No, it's... Over there! Oh, hello, friend. I was out destroying the wilderness, I see. Terrain? The hell is that? Well, it's either yes, ether clock is not very high, so at least there's that. But um, this is probably too many people for us to deal with, so we should probably run. Monsters. Noah, look. That's Ethel. You said Ethel. You mean Silver Code Ethel. You know about her. Even in Agnes, the name has spread far and wide. Silver Code Ethel. A veteran soldier unmatched in strength. People would whisper about how she fell three colonies at once with just a hundred troops. Yeah, but. This is Ethel. We know her name. So? So, she helped us out once before. She was strong, but kind. She could still help. Noah? It might not work, but... Noah! It's all right.
I've no recollection of helping. You! <laughs> Pointless. Sorry. I thought I could convince her. Shit, man, it wouldn't work. Taking cover. Bad move. Very well done, Ethel. I do so love your loyalty. Now, the enemy is before you. Chase them to the ends of the world. Not a single one of them can escape. I wonder what's around here. I was kind of actually wondering what they see. No amount of healing is gonna help that big hits us. We should retreat under cover then. We've been spotted. Well, we've been found. Ah. Uh... Gotta keep their attention. I'm thinking let's just keep running. Whoa. Yep. That's about what I was expecting. Yep, just keep them coming. No problem. Look out! Risky business. Doesn't help that their cannons are way too accurate. They shouldn't be able to see us from over there. How do they know location of Manana and friends? The Iris. There? Her red Iris is doing this. It's relaying our exact position to her troops. Snuff this! Lads, six o'clock! Spark! Again. The soldiers. Their whole squad. Those heartless mudders. Guys, pull back to the cave. What cave? We're sitting bunnets out here. In there, we can take cover from the volleys. And after that? Think about that later. No plan B. I didn't have time. You can't run from me, brat. I've got my eye on you. Slow me down. I still have eyes on the prize. Better give it a good once over. I don't like this fog one bit. More enemies. What do we do?
from the Shannon, huh? I can't tell where this leads, but all we can do is keep moving forward. Get ready to fight! I fail to realize once again that I was muted. Hey, Jewel. There keeps being noise everywhere, which prompts me to mute myself all the time. Okay, we finally dealt with all of these guys. Let's go ahead and get this out of the way. Yeah, that is generally a pretty good indication of I'm trying to say something and just getting muted out. Okay, there is an invisible wall here, so we gotta fight these guys.
Once again, another case of I put down a uh, I put down an AOE and everyone walks out. No. Then what? The enemy's acting strangely. Something's off. Off how? Even when we engage, the other soldiers don't provide backup. It's like none of them have been given orders. You're overthinking it. I thought I was at first. Hey, Noah. Yeah. I agree with Tyon. He did seem kind of slow to respond. Oh, no. Well, considering that they see us as basically like evil dark blobs walking around. That, looks like a good rest spot. that probably explains a few things. Yeah, there's a trader pawn here. Yes, good hello. Okay, uh, boost evasion by 10 percent. Damage dealt, dealing uh, attacking the enemies targeting targeting you. Yeah, it does. Standards dealt by 10% and HP is at 30% or lower. It's block rate by 30%. Pop of resistance by 20. And boost damage by 10% for every enemy in battle. Interesting. Now, I'm not talking to you. Let's see what you have. Peeking you. Oh, my plumage is everywhere. What need from kicking you? If shopping, please wait a while. Sorry to pop up out of nowhere, but we've come on Shil Shil's order. Ah, that thing. If one stone, near stone is. Will that be all? If so, Kiki need me to make tracks. Rude, but okay. Kiki knew has wings full because Totutu has run off somewhere. Totutu have tendency for wandering feet. If you're busy, then we won't bother you any further. Thanks for this. Thanks for this. Terrible fuss kicking up from inside of cave. Something to do with friends, maybe? Mm -hmm. Okay, there, lands. Uh, yeah, maybe. In times of hard, friends should remember fruit of training. That and do shopping. Training, eh? That makes sense. Not sure about the shopping, though. Be properly equipped is very important. Therefore, buy from Kikinu or risk being dead by roadside and Ferris dinner. Ferris dinner. Uh, is there anything else over here? No, just everyone, get some rest. Go ahead and level everyone up. Unfortunately, they are now not the same level because of uh, experience disparities. But whatever. Ah, yes. Got it. Nope. <laughs> clean your body, clean your mind, I guess. Uh, do we have anything to make gems with?
The answer is yes. We have a really decent selection of, uh, of stuff here. So from the looks of it, we can only make one of each kind of gem. And we can use Nopon coins to make this too. Go with oh, oh. finished. No bad job. That's how it's done. Not a bad job. I'm all um, and ready to take on the world. Let's see about. A little bit of reorganization of classes here. There should be a few more options now. So we could make Noah a healer, or we could make him the other kind of tank. Don't really like either of those options. So I think what I would like See, I want some DPS here, but the problem is the DPS that we got, like the, the tanks that we got, um, like the, uh, the DPS class that she has available is the one that she started with, which is currently at rank 10 and cannot be ranked up further. So I would have to wait for her to get Sword Fighter, really. And pretty much the same deal ish with Noah, except that he's not e he's not even that close to getting over. Apparently, I could use some Napon coins to unlock this stuff. How much would it cost for this? Oh, I can use Nopon coins to rank up. I cannot use them to unlock new things. Noted. Okay. Well, I guess I'm not changing anyone yet. 
which actually, considering that I'm not changing anyone yet, might be a good idea for me to um, assign some gems. Your heels. The multiple people can equip the same gems. And once everyone gets to level 20, then they can equip two gems. Double the fun. Uh, actually, before I say, let's see if there's any uh, food books that I can get. Uh, is that the only one that I have? Apparently it is. just kind of looking at what uh, Mio and Sen are doing over there. I think they're just kind of doing like some sort of stretches. I don't know, these scenes are kind of cute, honestly. It's vital to keep a record of events. Anyway, this game only gives us three files, so as I said last time, I'm just gonna save over follow one. Anyway. to murder some wildlife. Hey, they, they started the fight. <laughs> their fault that they're made of materials. Uh, I was more thinking their, far, their, their fault that they started it. Just want to hug. Okay, now this one is shiny. Days. Someone just yelled roast me.
There's an ether deposit there. Oh, we've been spotted by troops. Okay, I found out how to control the camera. Oh, and now the elite's on us, too. And much like that, uh, much like that one space exploration game, Elite Dangerous. So. Okay, Lance needs help. Lance needs healing. There we go. Now there's big friend. Y'all need to get in the circle. Good combo. Good combo. Let's chain attack. Probably don't need to, but uh, um, Side, so I'll just do that, I guess. Cool. Unfortunately, we don't really have a whole lot more to work with here. percent all right ether channel good thing we found this It's open. Queen's wings, finally. Whoa, check this place out. Ah, uh, my favorite Digimon, Hegemon.
we can get down from the left side. With any luck, we can lead them the wrong way. Huh. No, that's not going to work out. us at all disgusting huh the sight of you things speaking the words of man it makes my skin crawl huh we'll never get through come off it just what the spark does she see us as goggles she's right there why don't you ask her right, we'll get a straight answer all right she wants to fight, I guess we're gonna fight her. Get the ads first. All the eyes are down. Jane attack it is. Didn't seem to be very effective for anybody. Are we on her side? Or kind of in front? Good. We have one, we have two turns left. Um, I guess this. I noticed that there's a space for like Arboros orders there. So is is that how we end up combining into Arboros? You 
I'm not sure if I yelled no over there. But he is definitely dead now. Are you doing all right? Son, you're not doing all right. There we go. Too good. Well, I guess we don't call a silver coat Ethel for nothing, eh? Tight pinch keeps getting tighter. Mimi, understood. Ready? We can't. But why not? It's too powerful. We could just wind up killing her. Yes, but. She just stopped. Uh, what? What? What am I fighting against here? Maybe now. Ethel! It's me! It's Noah! Did you say Noah? Ethel! <laughs> Needs must. <gasps> Consul. Really? This is why I can't stand far. And we were just getting to the good part. Consul. I I'm what the what am I? Silence! You were pathetic. Whoa. Ethel! <laughs> this friggin' smite. Well, don't you agree? It's the big bad boss. Boom! Here I come! I'll press a left to have the character you're controlling interlink with their partner. The Arboros form is is both resilient and powerful. It looks like it's forcing me to be uh, Noah here. Here we go. While two characters are interlinked, you can use Urboros hearts as much as you want, but be aware that the heat gauge will fill up over time. If the heat fill if the heat gauge fills up all the way, the interlink will be cancelled, leaving you unable to interlink for a while. You can cancel cancel an interlink at any time by pressing down. This should deal considerable damage, even to the motive. Oh. I can't get anyone. Thank you. 
So I'm going to link again. See if we can hit chain attack before we uh, overheat here. Oh, this is going to be close. Nope. And now we got, uh, now we got chain attack available to us. And the thing overheating. Get the ads. Set us down. Now let's do this. Uh, what do you? Let's yeah, let's go up there as well. I'm never sure what I need to do to like break the point limit. There we go. And yeah, we're gonna go out again. You're in for it now. Someday I'll be able to to make it even higher than that. Anyway, let's our boss again. Stop missing. Oh, geez. Bad cancer. Something's wrong. The light's being drawn in. Same as when Noah and Mimi. Magic wand, make my monster grow! He transformed. He looks exactly like that other one. That Iris. So he was the one controlling the troops. Mobius. But he's looking pretty hurt. 
Come on! Oh, good. Oh. Uh... Any good? He did it again. No way. He's stealing from the clocks. <laughs> My dear boy. Just straight up letting us have it, huh? I, as Mobius, have the right to do with the flame cloth as I please. You may hurt me as much as your heart's desire, but where there is life and vitality, I'm afraid I shall not fall. Come now. Why don't you give it your best shot? And have at me! <laughs> if you think you can. Stop attacking! Uni! Lance! You must be fucking joking! If we let up now, he'll take us down! But our friends from Colony 4! Wake up, Noah! They're not your friends anymore. They're his fuel. <gasps> Even so. <laughs> These soldiers will nourish me like glitter radishes in season. And we can always grow plenty more. If I need a little extra, I can pluck them whenever I want. <sighs> He's killing more of our friends, the more we hate him. There has got to be a way. What if we... But then... What? Did you think of something? Huh? Come on! The flame clock. What if we smashed it? You what? How should I know something like... Do you mean... But... What if we just end up killing everybody? If we keep fighting like this, we're all dead. Rock in a hard place, huh? Whatever life is lost, I won't let you shoulder it all alone. Mia. <sighs> I think it's about time we entered the final act. Oh dear. All right. We'll try it. Lance! What's up? Draw his attention for me. And then what? I'll get in close and destroy the flame clock. What? But if you do that, we've got to. It's the only way. On my head be it! you on about? I'm not gonna let you take the fall alone! No, snuff it! Fine! Have it your way! Get going! Uni! Cover fire! Leave it to me! Tyon! Senna! We need you too! Huh? <laughs> Understood. Just say when, guys! Thanks, everyone. I'll count down from three. Three, two, one, let's go! <laughs> I know what you're thinking. However... If I keep on firing pot shots, I'm bound to hit one of you sooner or later, preferably sooner! Oh, here we go.
Well, we now have access to a second Aurorus. Now for the coup de grace, let's do the same thing. Alright, just giving us all of them. as well. All together now. Get sliced to itsy bits. If it can really take a voice clean out, then maybe. Mio, try again. Cancel the interlink after we jump. What's the plan? Looks like the time's come. What are you talking about? Fine, ready when you are. Hey, so bang shot. Oh. The 
Everyone okay? She's gonna be fine. Seems she only lost consciousness. Right. That's good. Which leaves... Someone who deserves a real thrashing. Playing with our lives like they're nothing. You're dead meat! This guy is defending a lot. Do that. Oh, nice. We're not making another one, though. I'll start and finish, really. Oh, geez. That, that put us up to 99% in one single attack, which was pretty good.
Sona, you should probably let me have aggro. Why? Stand inside the Venn diagram. Oh, hey. All right. Y'all going over Boris? So am I. I don't think you're aggroed on the Who are you aggroed on? Like, I don't see the aggro line at all. Oh, over there. Someone, I guess. Fifty-eight. Yeah, I don't think we're gonna. Nope. Come on, stop blocking me. I wonder if I can save from death by doing no boss. Lands, you are not a tank. Give me aggro. Neo, you're not specced as a tank either. Okay, Senna, Senna's gone. This fight is kinda rough.
Let's get you finished. There we go. Oh my goodness. I get the sense that these this, this Mobius guy did not understand around, his mortality. Let's take a look at this ugly mother's face. Yeah. Stuck tight. How'd you get this thing off? Ah. Huh? This guy. He's so different from us. Is this what consoles look like? All wrinkled. Just like Guernica. Is this what aging's like? I don't know. Ah, uh. oh, it's you. I see. I'm so sorry. All I remember is that I was fighting against some abhorrent creatures. And you tell me it was you. So this is the consul. This is how he really looks. He's fading. Just like during a homecoming. Seems appropriate. Nope, no way. You're not sending him on. You realize how messed up that is? Huh? You think so? How do you not? Think about the things this guy did. He tried to kill us all and rob the soldiers of their remaining life. You're right. Both of you are right. And Mio? Honestly, I'm not sure I would. Okay. Oh, I'll just do it anyway. Just now, I felt his essence brush past me. It felt just the same as ours. So, I feel I have to do this, you know? Mm. Mio, have you ever touched a mote of light from a Kavesi? <sighs> They're the same as ours. On the other side, the people live hoping the same things as us. Well, he's started now. Sometimes, he's just too kind. That or he just loves his job. He too by the book. An airhead. That's what he is. Don't think he's thinking about it too deeply. Just doing it because it's part of his nature, eh? Hmm. 
weirdo. I concur. Mimi. Sorry, we didn't have to help. It's fine. It's our duty. I'm worried I didn't play well. But why? You did it expertly, just like last time. I still can't stop shaking. Because of the flame clock? Yeah. I was terrified. Still, all thanks to your decision, we're alive. You're really something. It was a team effort. Not gonna lie, guys. Noah's like super cute, especially when he's thinking. Commander! You're Agnes! Lower your weapons, Boliaris. Come again? I'll explain everything to you later. Please, Boliaris. Uh, sure. Then it seems the flame clock is indeed gone, as you say. And yet, I'm seeing nothing of these symbols you speak of. It seems evident you possess something that we do not have. I see. Sorry for getting you involved. No need to apologize. Exceptional as this is, I consider it a blessing to be freed from constant battle. Glad to hear you say that. I was pretty worried. Are you sure it's okay for us to be hanging around here? My troops are under strict orders. It's true you three are affiliated with Agnes, but we also owe you our lives. We should count our blessings, no? This feels awkward. We can stick it out. Sorry. This is kind of our fault. Don't worry about it. You heard Ethel, right? Hmm. Infinity Blade is Noah's unique talent art that he can equip regardless of his class. It lets him achieve Lucky 7 to deal damage that bypasses defense. Ooh, powering up our Boris. In the main menu, go to Characters, Interlink, Soul Tree. To access a menu where you can spend the SP you earned in battle, to upgrade the characters for a boss forge. So I guess that's pretty much the game loop. Is we're going to go around um, killing Mobii and kind of releasing Um, uh, 
like releasing the various colonies. Plus. You found power. You know, bring the soul tree as long as you have enough soul points to do so. I'm guessing you want me to just spend all of my points. You found power. They're not forcing me down a specific path. Which at least there's that. How do I get this one? I just kind of... Oh wait, now I see the line. You found power. You found power. You found power. There we go. Activate the Unlock Arts Cancelling mode on a character's soul tree to enable the cancelling of arts into other arts. Cancelling an art into an art fills up the heat gauge, but it also ch uh, charges up the talent art gauge and allows the art to come out quicker, making it an efficient source of damage. So this is where the affinity thing actually comes into play. Because now that we've um, pretty much released these guys from uh, high command, um, we can now just be here and hang out. It's good to keep a record. It is good to keep a record. And uh, I have been keeping a record of what time it is. We are 15, we are 16 minutes late for break. Um, there is definitely a reason why they're called Monolith Soft. Because their cutscenes and sequences are monoliths of their own. So, uh, let us go ahead and take a break. Uh, and get uh, get a drink, go to the bathroom if you need to, stretch your arms, stretch your legs, stretch your teeth. And once we come back, we'll take a look around Colony 4 and uh, see if there is any, um, any quests to get, any people to talk to, anything that can help us along our journey. So, I'll see you in a bit. <laughs> 